MCAP reviewer for 2020. So, ang mga questions po is from MCAP 2019 elimination round. So, ginawan ko po siya ng solution and explanation. So, pang number 23 na po ito. So, kung gusto nyo po pong manood ng mga uploads ko, ayan, um, visit lang po kayo sa channel ko. Number 1 question. Calculate 81 divided by 15 times 14 divided by 27 times 5 divided by 7. Okay? So, ang format ni ginawa ko is um, pang shortcut na po ito. So, 81 over 15 times 14 over 27 times 5 over 7. So, pag nag-multiply tayo nag ng fraction, uh, minumultiply natin yung numerator to numerator and denominator to denominator. Okay, pero pwede naman natin siyang isimplify through dividing the numerator to the denominator or simplify. Okay, 81 divided by 27 is 3 and 14 divided by 7 is 2. And then, uh, 5 over 15, hindi natin siya pwedeng i-divide pero pwede natin siyang isimplify. Okay, so 15 divided by 5 is 3. Kaya mayroon tayong 3 dito sa may 15, na-cancel na yung 5. Okay, so and then uh, mayroon pa tayong pwedeng i-simplify which is yung 3 na nasa 81, taas ng 81 and 3 na nasa taas ng 15. So, 3 divided by 3 is 1 or we can cancel 3. And the answer is 2. Okay, question number 2. Calculate 16 times 4 times 8 times 125 divided by 1000. So, solution natin dito is apply natin siya M das rule which is M is multiplication, D is division, A is addition, S is subtraction. So, M mul multiplication. So, ita times muna natin. Uh, 16 times 4 times 8 times 125 is 64,000. And then, 64,000, i-divide natin sa 1,000. 64,000 divided by 1,000 is 64. Okay, next, number 3. What is the sum of 0 0.48, 10.2, 0 0.03, and 8? So, i-add natin because of the word sum. Okay, so ang unang gagawin natin is pagtatapat-tapatin natin yung decimal nila. So tulad ng ginawa ko, yan, magkakatapat yung mga point nila. Then, we have the whole number, so kailangan na sa my left side siya before the decimal. And then, we're going to add 8 plus 3 is 11, so carry 1. 1 plus 4 is 5 plus 2 is 7. And then, uh, doon natin itatapat yung tuldo. O itatapat lang natin yung point. And then, 0, 0, 0 plus 8 is 8. And 1, I'll oh, bring down 1. So, the answer is 18.71. Okay, number 4. What is the quotient when 0 0.1 is divided by 0 0.02? So, solution natin, since um, ang, ang divisor natin is 0 0.02, magmumove tayo ng 2 decimal places going to the right direction. Same lang din gagawin natin dun sa dividend mag from the point or from the decimal mag, mag uh, mumove tayo ng 2 places to the right. Okay? Kung ilan yung minove natin dun sa divisor, ganun din yung imumove natin dun sa dividend. Okay? So, meron tayong new um, new divisor which is positive 2 or 2 and the new dividend is 10. So, divide na natin. 10 divided by 2 is 5. 5 times 2 is equals to 10. 10 minus 10 is 0. So, the quotient is 5. Okay, next, number 5. What is the product of 0 0.2 times 0 0.2 times 0 0.2? Ito yung solution natin. Ayan. So, 0 0.2 times 0 0.2 times 0 0.2, ayan, 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is equal to 8. Okay, so note na mayroon tayong decimal point, bibilangin natin yun, 1, 2, 3. So, yung naka-encircle na yellow. And then, um, magbibilang din tayo ng, doon sa answer natin, sa product natin, magbibilang din tayo ng 3 decimal places mula doon sa 8 papuntang left. So, 1, 2, 3, ayan, nag-add tayo ng dalawang 0. 
Okay, that's all for now. Thank you for watching. Please click the like, subscribe, and the bell button below for more videos. You can also visit my YouTube channel, Matish, for my complete uploads. Okay, may mga i-upload pa po ako mamaya, so abangan lang po natin. Thank you so much, guys.